New Mexico Signs Road Situations Practice Test Question 1. What must you do at a flashing red signal? Yield as you would at a yield sign. Yield to all traffic, unless you are on the busier roadway. Proceed through with caution, this signal is out of order. Stop and yield as you would at a stop sign. Answer Stop and yield as you would at a stop sign. Question 2. A pedestrian with a white cane enters the road ahead. What should you do? Drive around the pedestrian. Stop and sound your horn. Sound your horn. Stop and yield to the pedestrian. Answer. Stop and yield to the pedestrian. Question 3. When can you use the shoulder of the road to pass another vehicle? When you are passing a vehicle that is turning left, you can always pass on the shoulder. You can pass on the shoulder anywhere the speed limit is 25 miles per hour or below. You cannot pass using the shoulder. Answer You cannot pass using the shoulder. Question 4. What must you do before entering a road from an alley or driveway in a built-up area? Sound your horn and proceed with care. Stop if there are pedestrians present, otherwise yield to traffic. Stop and yield to all traffic and pedestrians. Yield to all traffic and pedestrians. Answer. Stop and yield to all traffic and pedestrians. Question 5. Which car is turning left correctly here? Neither car. Car B. Both cars. Car A. Answer. Car B. Question 6. You see an octagonal sign at an intersection. What must you do here? Stop and yield to traffic. Proceed with caution. Slow down and yield to traffic. Proceed straight through when safe. There are no left or right turns allowed here. Answer. Stop and yield to traffic. Question 7. You see an ambulance approach with its flashing lights on. What must you do? Maintain speed and direction. Changing lanes or stopping is unpredictable and dangerous. Pull over and stop for any ambulance that is approaching from behind. Pull over and stop for any ambulance. Slow down. Answer. Pull over and stop for any ambulance. Question 8. You see a hall two lane. When can you drive in this lane? Never. This lane is for buses and trucks. When you have no less than one passenger. When you have no less than two passengers. At any time. Answer. When you have no less than one passenger. Question 9. What is New Mexico's school zone speed limit when children are present? 10 miles per hour. 15 miles per hour. 25 miles per hour. 20 miles per hour. 
Answer. 15 miles per hour. Question 10. What does this sign mean? No passing. Prepare to stop in the work zone ahead. Slow vehicle. Stop. Answer. Slow vehicle. Question 11. Can you turn left at a red signal? Only when you are turning onto a one-way street. Yes, anywhere not prohibited by a sign. Only when you are turning between two one-way streets. No, you cannot turn left at a red signal in New Mexico. Answer. Only when you are turning between two one-way streets. Question 12. You arrive at a railroad crossing without any stop line. A train is coming. Where must you stop? 15 to 50 feet from the tracks. 10 feet from the tracks. Immediately in front of the tracks. 30 to 60 feet from the tracks. Answer. 15 to 50 feet from the tracks. Question 13. You are following another vehicle, but you may be a little too close. What is the minimum following distance? At least 3 seconds. About 5 feet, far enough to see the car in front's brake signals. At least 20 feet. At least 2 seconds. Answer. At least 3 seconds. Question 14. What does this sign mean? The speed limit at night is 50 miles per hour. The recommended speed limit is 50 miles per hour. The minimum speed limit is 50 miles per hour. The maximum speed limit is 50 miles per hour. Answer. The maximum speed limit is 50 miles per hour. Question 15. Which of the following actions are optional when changing lanes? Checking your mirrors. Using your turn signals. Looking over your shoulder. None of the above. Answer. None of the above. Question 16. What does this sign mean? Extra lane forming ahead. Divided highway begins. No left turns ahead. Traffic highland ahead. Answer. Divided highway begins. Question 17. You see a flashing yellow X above a reversible lane. What does this signal mean? This lane is for left turns only. This lane is for half usage only. This lane is about to close. This lane is open, but proceed with care. Answer. This lane is for left turns only. Question 18. Two cars arrive at a four-way stop at the same time. Who has right of way? The car on the busier road has right of way. Car A. One of the cars should just proceed and take right of way. Car B. Answer. Car B. Question 19. 
Which one of the following is true about right of way? Right of way is illegal right. You should claim right of way wherever possible. Right of way is to be given, not taken. You can always go when you have right of way. Answer Right of way is to be given, not taken. Question 20. You are on a divided highway. You see a school bus stopped with red flashing signals on the opposite side of the road. What must you do? Stop before reaching the bus position. Proceed with caution. Come to a complete stop, yield if necessary, and then proceed. Slow down to 15 miles per hour and proceed with caution. Answer Proceed with caution. Question 21 Which car is hidden in the truck's blind spot? Corza and C. Car B. Car C. Car A. Answer. Carby. Question 22. Three cars arrive at an intersection with yield signs. Who has right of way? Carby. Corza and C. Car A. Car C. Answer. Carby. Question 23. You arrive at an intersection with this sign. What must you do here? Stop and yield to traffic. Only yield if you are turning. Slow down and yield to traffic. Cue behind any traffic already in the intersection. Answer. Slow down and yield to traffic. Question 24. Two cars arrive at an intersection at the same time. Which of the following is true? You must yield to oncoming vehicles when you turn left. You have right of way if you are on the busier road. You must yield to all vehicles turning left across your path at an intersection. One driver should proceed first and take right of way. Answer You must yield to oncoming vehicles when you turn left. Question 25 Which of the following is true? The car on the left should yield to its right. The car on the busier road has right of way. One driver should proceed first and take right of way. The car on the right should yield to its left. Answer The car on the left should yield to its right. Question 26 you see a lane marked out by two sets of broken yellow lines. What sort of lane is this? High occupancy vehicle, HAV, lane. Central turning lane. Shared central parking area. Reversible lane. Answer. Reversible lane. Question 27. Are any of the following statements false? You should drive with your parking lights on during the day. You must use your headlights whenever visibility is difficult at 500 feet. You must use your headlights from half an hour after sunset to half an hour before sunrise. All of these statements are true. Answer 
You should drive with your parking lights on during the day. Question 28. You are turning on to a driveway. Who must you yield to here? No one. You have right of way. All vehicles and pedestrians. Only oncoming vehicles. Only pedestrians on the sidewalk. Answer. All vehicles and pedestrians. Question 29. Can you turn right at a red signal? Yes, but only after stopping and yielding to all traffic and pedestrians. No, not in New Mexico. Yes, you should have right of way here. Yes, but only after yielding to all traffic and pedestrians. Answer. Yes, but only after stopping and yielding to all traffic and pedestrians. Question 30. You see a pennant-shaped sign. What does this sign mean? No parking. No passing. Right turn ahead. Keep right in work zone. Answer. No passing. Question 31. Who must wear a seat belt? No one. Seat belts are optional in New Mexico. Only the driver, all front seat passengers, and those under 16. Every vehicle occupant. Only the driver and any passenger under 16. Answer. Every vehicle occupant. Question 32. What must you do at a steady yellow traffic signal? Stop before entering the intersection if it is safe and possible. Drive with caution as there may be a hazard ahead. Treat the intersection like a four-way stop. You can speed up to cross the intersection before the signal turns red. Answer. Stop before entering the intersection if it is safe and possible. Question 33. Two cars have arrived at an intersection at the same time. Who must yield here? Car B must yield as it is turning right. The car in the busier lane has right of way. This is an uncontrolled intersection. One driver must let the other driver through. Car A must yield as it is turning left. Answer. Car A must yield as it is turning left. Question 34. What must you do at a yellow flashing traffic signal? Stop and yield as you would at a stop sign. Slow down and proceed with caution. Proceed straight through when safe, there are no left or right turns allowed here. Yield as you would at a yield sign. Answer. Slow down and proceed with caution. Question 35. This sign is pentagonal. What sort of sign is this? A work zone sign. A school sign. A no passing sign. A warning sign. Answer. A school sign. Question 36. In which of the following locations can you legally park? A 10 feet from a fire hydrant. B. On a bridge. C. On the sidewalk. D. 
10 inches from the curb? Answer. D 10 inches from the curb. Question 37. Car B has entered an intersection to turn right. Car has arrived with a green signal. Which of the following is true? Car should queue through the intersection behind Car B. Cora must stop and yield to Car B. Car B must stop and let Car through. Car should speed up and pass Car B. Answer. Cora must stop and yield to Car B. Question 38. You are about to make a right turn at a red signal. A pedestrian enters the road ahead. What should you do? Turn into the far lane and pass the pedestrian. Sound your horn to alert the pedestrian of your presence. Stop and let the pedestrian cross. Speed up to pass the pedestrian. Answer. Stop and let the pedestrian cross. Question 39. When must you dim your high beams? When you are within 200 feet of an oncoming vehicle or following a vehicle within 500 feet, you are not required to dim your high beams in New Mexico. When you are within 500 feet of an oncoming vehicle or following a vehicle within 200 feet, when you are within 200 feet of any vehicle, Answer. When you are within 500 feet of an oncoming vehicle or following a vehicle within 200 feet. Question 40. What is the fault speed limit for New Mexico's residential and business areas? 40 miles per hour. 30 miles per hour. 35 miles per hour. 25 miles per hour. Answer. 30 miles per hour. Question 41. This driver is using a hand signal. What is the driver planning to do? This is not a valid hand signal. Turn left. Stop or slow down. Turn right. Answer. Stop or slow down. Question 42. You see an emergency vehicle stop ahead with its flashing lights on. What must you do? You have no legal requirement here. Leave a vacant lane next to the emergency vehicle if possible. Otherwise, prepare to stop. Slow down. Leave a vacant lane next to the emergency vehicle if possible. Answer. Leave a vacant lane next to the emergency vehicle if possible. Otherwise, prepare to stop. Question 43. Which of the following is not true about New Mexico's speed limits? Driving too slowly is dangerous. You can exceed the speed limit by 10 miles per hour when passing on a two-lane highway. Sometimes the posted speed limit can be too fast. Slow vehicles should drive in the right lane and let others pass wherever possible. Answer. You can exceed the speed limit by 10 miles per hour when passing on a two-lane highway. Question 44. Three cars arrive at this four-way stop, one after another. In what order can these cars proceed? Car C, B, and then A. Cars A, C, 
and then B. Cars B, C, and then A. Cars B, A, and then C. Answer. Cars B, A, and then C. Question 45. Can you turn left here? Yes, you can proceed as you have right of way. Yes, but you will have to yield to all oncoming traffic. No, these lights are clearly out of order. No, you must wait for the red signal to change. Answer Yes, but you will have to yield to all oncoming traffic. Question 46. What does this sign mean? Truck route ahead. Emergency truck ramp ahead. Truck centering from steep side road. Steep descent ahead. Answer. Steep descent ahead. Question 47. You are turning at an intersection and you cannot see any other vehicles around. Do you still need to signal? No, you are only required to signal when other vehicles are present. No, turn signals are optional in New Mexico. Yes, you must signal for at least 50 feet. Yes, you must signal for at least 100 feet. Answer. Yes, you must signal for at least 100 feet. Question 48. A school bus with flashing red signals has stopped on the two-lane road ahead. What must you do? Slow down to 15 miles per hour and proceed with caution. Stop before reaching the bus. Proceed with caution. Stop, but only if you are traveling in the same direction as the bus. Answer. Stop before reaching the bus. Question 49. What does this sign mean? There is an uncontrolled intersection ahead. There is a railroad crossing ahead. You are going the wrong way, turn around and go back. There is a four-way stop ahead. Answer There is a railroad crossing ahead. Question 50. In which of the following locations can you legally park? A 15 feet from a crosswalk at an intersection. B 35 feet from a railroad crossing. C 35 feet from a stop sign. D. None of the above. Answer. C 35 feet from a stop sign. Thank you for watching the video and wish you will get your driver license soon.